One of the ongoing questions I keep hearing from uh, clients, both on the retail side and on the institutional side, is how can possibly bond yields go lower, i.e. bond prices go higher, if the Fed wants to keep the uh, Fed funds rate uh, where it is right now? So how can that work? Well, I'm going to show you a chart in a second, but basically the Fed funds rate is the only thing that the Fed controls. The Treasury market, even the two-year, that trades freely in the market. That's a supply and demand issue. So let me show you what that looks like. I have a cool chart that's going to, I think, clear things up. And so what I did here is I, I took one one point in time, this was in the 90s, where you can see the Fed funds rate kept stable uh, for years, but the two-year yield dropped from, like, in this case, it was like 7% or 75 all the way down to like four, right? So that this is the freely traded treasury market, but the Fed funds rate kept. So this this can happen. The, the market tends to front run the Fed, and that's how that works.